Alright, this video we're going to talk about uh, how to stretch uh, the median nerve or if we're getting any kind of numbness tingling in the hand and oftentimes this lends to folks that have carpal tunnel or get hand numbness while being on the computer or sleeping in funny positions, you wake up with hand numbness. So we're going to show you a stretch on how to start to alleviate some of that. So I'm going to have Annie take a seat here. Alright, so what I'm going to do is have Annie sit and she's going to bring her arm into this position with her hand flat like she's serving a tray of food. She's also going to depress the shoulder blade. This is going to open up the space in her neck and allow for that neck to glide and move a little bit easier. So what we're going to do is, if I were to stretch her out in this position, we're looking at the nerves that come out of the neck, come underneath the upper trap here, which is called our brachial plexus, run down the front of the arm, and then into the hand. This is the often the kind of the main culprit of any kind of carpal tunnel syndrome or any numbness tingling that settles in the, in the arm, the forearm, the upper arm, or even into the hand. So what we're going to do as she's in this position, shoulder blade stays down. She's going to rotate the hand towards the out, extend the fingers back. And as she's doing that, she's going to tilt the head towards and then come back. So what we're doing is, again, we're gliding that nerve through the system. So if we had a string that went from her ear to her hand, we're going to be putting tension on the lower part of that string and taking tension off the top part of the string at the neck and then come back. You may feel a little numbness, tingling, or burning sensation in the hand, and that's okay. You're going to take that to about the range of motion where I'm not provoking any kind of pain, but if you're getting a little bit of sensation here, that's okay. Most folks actually won't feel much of anything. And again, we're going to perform probably 10 to 20 repetitions and we're going to do this at least two or three times a day. So if you're sitting at your desk or at the computer for a long period of time, this is something you can even do maybe even on the hour to help keep that neck and the hand stretched out. So it's an easy stretch to do to alleviate some hand numbness and tingling or if we're stuck on the computer all day and start to get those carpal tunnel syndromes, it's a nice way to start to alleviate and prevent those symptoms.